Vielen Dank. Und jetzt für die Thank Grüne Fraktion für zwei Minuten Bas Eckert. Thank you very much, Mr. Chairman. And first of all, I also would like to thank the co-rapporteurs on a very good job on a report and recommendations. And I think the conclusions of the inquiry committee are very clear. Dieselgate scandal could have been prevented if the national authorities and the European Commission have done their work. It could have been prevented. It was not. And for all those people who thought we were helping the car industry with that, they are the ones being punished now the most because internationally there's a big lack of trust in European car manufacturers. And there you see that relaxed politicians towards the car industry are worse for them than the ones who try to be tough and fair from the start. Let that be a lesson for all our legislators. And if you look at the conclusions, there are six counts of maladministration on member states. There are five contraventions of European law identified in this report, but there are also seven counts of maladministration done by the European Commission in our conclusions. So those who say we have the full trust in the Commission, maybe you should you read your own report. Seven counts of maladministration. That shows that something needs to happen and needs to change also within the European Commission. And I think that is an important one as well. But my most important point is at the end. There are still a lot of polluting cars on the street as we speak. And we know that a lot of these car manufacturers produced defeat devices, are using defeat devices. If you apply your own guidelines, you will identify that a lot of car manufacturers are applying defeat devices. That is forbidden by law. Until now, no European car is forced to recall cars from the European streets. It's really time for action. And if the member states don't do, European Commission, you have all the powers to address those national authorities. And it's time you do that now.